second YouTube video number two. Okay. Today I will be doing reviews on the Pop Sugar Must Have box as well as the Candy Club box monthly. This is the Pop Sugar Must Have box. I will be reviewing this first. I did already open everything. I didn't realize my Candy Club box was here yet. So I had opened everything, made a video, and decided that I should just put the two videos together. My hair is a little funky. I am sorry about that. Just got off work. Okay, so this is kind of what the inside of the box looks like. Of course, everything's wrapped up. I, of course, opened it because I already made a video and I'm redoing it. First item is this hand cream. It doesn't really have a smell, which is what you need if you have dry skin, which I do right now because it's winter and my hands are just terrible. It, every box comes with one of these and it tells you exactly how much everything costs. You're paying about $39.99 for this box a month. And I think it's worth it. You get full size products and everything in the box equals over what you paid for the box. Okay, so this Ultra Repair Hand Cream by Fab First Aid Beauty. This costs $28. Oh, sorry. And then the next thing is this hat. It is very soft. I like it. I try it on, but I don't want to mess with my hair any more than it already is. It's cute. This hat costs $32. So this hat and this repair cream cost more than your box does. So that definitely makes it worth it. Okay, I already opened this too. I wish I would have kept it, you know, sealed up so you can see. This is a yoga hand towel. It's really soft. It says it is, you can grip it when it's wet with sweat. And I really want to get into yoga so that, that's cool. I'm sorry if you hear my dogs, they're playing out there. That yoga towel costs $16. It is called a Manduka Equa hand towel. You also get Nature Valley granola protein, peanut butter, and dark chocolate. That, that's a large size and that is going to be delicious in yogurt. That costs three dollars and sixty eight cents and then there's this cup I'm it's kind of small it's a size medium I try to keep my coffee cups to a minimum I have a lot of coffee cups but I can always use another one I keep this in my car and I mean, that would be perfect for a small Starbucks drink if I didn't want, if I wanted to be conscious to the environment and have them put that in that cup. This is the last thing in the box. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't tell you how much that cost. That cup costs $26. It's the Brew 12 ounce reusable coffee cup by Keep Cup is the company. Okay. And then it came with this ad for the show Empire. Um, it's a little late because that show already started on January 7th. It kind of actually makes me want to watch this show. It looks pretty interesting. That's just an ad card. Sometimes they come with that stuff. And then it come, came with these skin jewel tattoos. And that costed $18. I'm not very excited about that. Um, I just feel like I'm 23 and I'm not going to use stick on tattoos anymore but I can give that to somebody um and my niece or nephew or something so everything in this box box I'm sorry costs way more than you are paying for the box so it, it's definitely worth it it's a lot of random things I thought it would be more of a beauty box which is more of what I'm into actually I'm sorry that was not everything from the box there's this eye treatment, under eye treatment. It fell out of the box. Um, I think this cost, it said about $16. When I first saw this, I thought they were giving me contacts. It just looks like the dry eyes contacts, contact solution. But it's not. It's an under eye treatment. I'm not very excited about this because 
I just have so many eye treatments and facials and I prescribe to subscribe. I can't talk today. I'm so sorry. Um, a lot of boxes and you know, whatever. Okay. This is my candy club box. I know these two boxes don't really go together, but it doesn't matter. I'm going to put them together. This is what the inside of the box looks like. I have not opened this box yet. Looks delicious. Ah, it's fun. Okay. So, I think this box is about $20 a month, $25 maybe. So, it comes with this and it describes all the candy you're getting. And on the back, it comes with nutrition facts as well. So you always get like an extra candy, which is like just laying in the box, like an old school candy. I hate these. I hate fireballs. They're hot. And I love hot stuff, but not that way. And then you get an extra candy, old school candy. And this is vanilla Turkish taffy. I've never tried these. That's cool. You also get three things of candy like you went from the candy store. So this one is the Sour Smiley Faces. These are so cute. I love these so much. So those are cute. Those are actually, let me, what is the real name for these? Albanese Sour Gummy Poppers. And it gives you some facts about each candy on this thing too. So that's, that's kind of cool. And I love candy. I know it's not healthy for you, but I just love it. And then this. Oh my gosh, it's little doggies, if you can see that. You see that? It looks like a Scottish terrier. It's super cute. Okay, that is Gimbal's Red Licorice Scotty Dogs. Those are so cute. I've never seen those before, and I love those. Oh, these look good. Those are Harbro Pink Grapefruit Gummy Candy. I also have not ever had those. So, I think both these boxes are worth it if candy and random stuff, um, if that's what you're into, I think they're both worth the money. I like them. This is only my second month getting both of these boxes, actually. The only thing that I do not like about Pop Sugar is they have terrible customer service. Terrible. They sent me, I paid for like six months or a year ahead of time so I can get the deal, so I can get a little cheaper. And they sent me two boxes, and I was freaking out. I don't want to be charged for two boxes. What do you even do with two of these boxes? I gave, I gave it away as a present, but um, they never. You can only email them. You there's no number to call. There's nothing. Just email. They never emailed me back. Um, but this month I only got one box. Maybe they caught their mistake. They did not charge me twice. I'm keeping an eye out to make sure they don't. But if you like my video, please. Pre oh my goodness, why do I keep saying prescribe? I used to work in the pharmacy. I work at a doctor's office now. Maybe that's why I'm saying it. I don't really know. Please subscribe below if you like this video. I will be doing a giveaway at 100 followers. Thank you for watching.